Hi, I'm Patrick Poon, the designer. I have very one important message for you guys in the washroom to avoid transmitting disease if any one of your family members or colleagues got infected without knowing and when they flush the toilet, it will transmit virus. To prevent it, let's do this with this little tool and prevent that. Okay, I'll show you. If I'm an infected person without knowing and when I flush the toilet, I may be transmitting the virus to my family members because the aerosol from the flushing can transmit the virus to the air and the next person that comes into the washroom can inhale and get infected. So it's very critical to prevent the aerosols from popping up through the flushing. So I want to do a demonstration. First of all, uh, how the flushing works. Okay, I'll just clean this here, make sure it's not any water. And then I'll put a little tissue paper over on top and then do the flushing so that uh, we see how the water comes up. Okay, and I think this washroom is kind of a newer version, so it's not too bad. And you can see these droplets showing up on the tissue paper. So this one, these bigger ones, and there's some on the side here, on the side here. So actually, this toilet seat would be covered with some droplets, and also this here. These droplets will go on here. So normally, you don't, you just uh, flush with the lid closed and these droplets will come here and here. But above all, uh, we worry about the little openings here that the aerosol will come out and carry the virus. That's where we want to avoid letting them out through here. So I guess my suggestion, one way is to get one of these file folders and reverse and use it and cover it up before you flush. So when you, that way it's all covered up and you don't worry about anything spilled onto the seat or here. So after you flush, then you just close it up and leave it here. Once um, the water vapor condensed into droplets, then it's not as harmful that it's not floating in the air. The other option would be using these polypropylene corrugated boards. It's very simple. Again, again, this, you just cover it up. Every time before you flush, put that lid on until the next person comes in. When you use it, you can easily, if it's for a small job, you can just lift it like this and then do the, the male part. But for the ladies, I guess you can actually put it at the back side and then make sure you put it back on before you flush. So hopefully the COVID-19 will be all covered up without escaping into the air to infect your family members. So it's very critical. I think this is something that a lot of people overlook and it's very important. So I, I hope you guys can do it right away because you never know if you any one of you get infected. So hopefully, remember, let's try our best to avoid the COVID-19 and everybody's happy. All right, thank you.